I legitimately love chawamushi. I never made it at home because it's the worst thing to make at home. It's actually really simple to make. It's really difficult to cook. So two things that you opened my eyes to about egg custard in the last year was one, the golden ratio. Which is the Peter Serpico rule. Right, which is seven eggs to one quart of flavorful liquid. Dashi, Correct. Correct. chicken stock, whatever. That was the first revelation. And then I saw you post microwave <laughs> chawamushi and I was like, that's the game. I know, that was in like the early phases that I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't really tell anybody what was going on. Seven eggs whipped. I like to use chopsticks or fork. You don't need it to be perfectly whisked. Um, and you want one quarter liquid. Again, it could be anything flavorful. You could even use water as long as you season it. And that's it. This is, <laughs> this is it. You can only cook chawamushi egg custard with steam. It has to be steamed. You can't do it in a saute pan, whatever. I've done anything from like, pour it, the egg custard in here, <laughs> and then, <laughs> so then you gotta search for the right thing. The right thing. All right, here, go. I mean, listen, it works. It's just not something that's easy to do, and minimum 30 minutes. Yeah. And what I like to do is, you know, I hate that this sounds like an infomercial. <laughs> Make a batch and use it throughout the week because this is something you can eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Goes great with rice, vegetables. It can be a main, it can be a side. And I can just took it in this and serve it. This is a thousand watt. I'm going to do this at 30% power, 18 minutes. But so this was actually a huge eye opener for me because I was like, Nothing's supposed to be in a microwave for more than a minute. It was you weird. thought I was insane. I thought it was gonna explode. There's a lot of different ways you can still cook this. You can do it up to 50% power. I like it at 30%, yeah. you know, and it, I think it worked out really well for me. Like, Even if it is 18 minutes, it's still, I'd say 50% yeah. faster. That's... You don't put everything in your, your oven at 500 <laughs> degrees or broil. What, you don't? You know? <laughs> Which is why I'm like, I'm like, wait a second. I can make something indiscernible, as you say, but I can do it in half the time. Why not? Because it's not cooking over fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the beefy way, man. Mine is uh, done. So, this is as good as a traditionally cooked tawa or egg custard. Yeah. Like, you're not gonna find any difference. Take this little one. This is, it's like one of my favorite things to eat. This is the kind of texture and deliciousness I would get at the best restaurants, done at home, done in the same container that I cooked in, that I'm gonna serve in, and it's insanely delicious. It's so fast, so this is what I tell everybody to make the first time they get it any day. Or you can just set it up like this and it's still cooking. Like now I can eat one of my favorite things to eat. Like that's, it's actually opened a huge door for me in my constant effort to gain more weight. <laughs> it's, pro it's protein, it's protein. <laughs>